everybody, how you doing? This is October 26, 2020, 7.21 p.m. So Monday evening, it's dark outside. Football's gonna start like an hour. My fantasy team's supposed to win. I'm playing one of those zombie teams where the guy doesn't reload his players and stuff, and he has like three guys on by, and there's a very good fucking chance he's gonna beat me because Tom Brady got four, threw for four touchdowns, and then he ran one in after that. You know how you know you're going to lose a football game is whenever your opponent has Tom Brady and he runs in a touchdown. <laughs> it's just, it's ridiculous. Anyway, I got like two players playing tonight. He has two players playing tonight, and I'm so far right now 15 points ahead. Three of his guys have got zero points, and he's only 15 points behind me. <laughs> uh, I'm ranting about my fantasy football. Uh, I'm ranting like Ivanka and Jared are ranting about this billboard in Times Square. Um, yeah, it really surprised me. Of course, when I went to Times Square last time, my, my only time I've been to Times Square, it was during the whole COVID thing last year, and I thought, hmm, not as big as I thought it was. So, then again, it was empty, and it was just like me, a couple construction workers, and some pigeons. So, but, um, I had fun. It was a good time. So, uh, but they're threatening to sue about these billboards for the Lincoln Project. I want to say something about the Lincoln Project. I really like what they're doing. I'm really fond of them, but liberals, you cannot just get used to them, okay? Because they're they're going to go back to being Republicans after this election, okay? Uh, two of my cartooning colleagues have done cartoons for them. And I have to say, if they do come to me, which they're not, I would say no. <laughs> because they, they're advertisers. They're they're campaigning. They're They're part of a campaign. So I cannot work for them, it's not journalism. So to my colleagues who have worked for them, uh, you might wanna stop. So, unless you're taking a break from drawing and working for newspapers and stuff like that, or any news outlets. So that's my little lecture to you guys. But anyway, Jared and Ivanka are upset about these billboards in Times Square. I guess because they'd like to go back to New York someday when this whole Trump disaster is over. But according to one Republican in New York, about the only place they can go would be Staten Island. And trust me, Princess Barbie do not want to go to Staten Island. Well, some liberal who loves me, a female, she wrote me upset that I drew Ivanka as a witch. And I thought, man, I know it's going to come up as sexist, but come on, it's Halloween. But she wasn't upset that way. It turns out that this reader is a witch. She's a Wiccan. She's like, you got to stop beating up on us witches. Don't make Ivanka one of us. I was like, okay. I thought it was about the whole sexist thing. I thought I was going to get accused of that. Anyway, let's go to our shout-outs. Our shout-out today is for TJ. And I do appreciate the TJ comments, but I get a little conflict here. I can't repeat what he writes because I, I've decided I'm not going to feed trolls. So whenever you just say something just outrageously stupid that's not going to turn out the way you want, I'm not going to read it. And whenever you spread a conspiracy theory, I'm not going to read that either. So thanks for the comments, TJ, you fucking loon. All right, everybody. Thanks for coming by and uh, watching. Listen to the guitar, and I'll talk to everybody on Tuesday. Bye.